Turning our attention now to the ASX, here's Matt Burney and Bulls and Bears with the latest public company views and interviews. Welcome to Bulls and Bears, where we break down the latest ASX announcements from public companies that are doing interesting things. Today's Bulls and Bears is brought to you by Singular Health, ASX code SHG. I'm Matt Burney and I'm joined now by the Managing Director of Singular Health, Tom Henley. Hi, Tom. Hi, Matt. Singular Health charged onto the ASX earlier this year with the company's share price more than quadrupling in the first few days of trade on the ASX. ASX on the back of its cutting-edge medical imaging technology. Singular's proprietary software can rapidly convert standard two-dimensional CT and MRI scans into three-dimensional models that can be evaluated by both patients and also their medical practitioners. The company recently entered into what it calls the scan-to-surgery market, which it says is worth some billions of dollars globally. Firstly, Tom, what exactly does scan-to-surgery mean and just how big is that market globally? Scan-to-surgery is the position where a patient will receive or, or go for a t- 2D MRI or CT scan. We can then visualize that in 3D and from that create an STL or computer aided drafting file which enables a bioengineer and surgeon to collaborate to then generate the kind of implants that are required and cutting dyes that require quite complex spinal and maxillofacial surgery. How big do you see that market being? About $4.4 billion a year and growing quite rapidly at around about 16 to 17% per annum. Very, very big market. Now I see you just bought a company by the name of VR Surgical which is in that space. What did you pay for that company and what do they do and what will they add to your suite of products? So we paid $250,000 in cash and $250,000 in shares for a company called VR Surgical and to have access to their software. So we're building their software into our platform. Basically what their software does is take that SDL file and allow surgeons and engineers to then build the specific implants and cutting guides and biomodels that are required before undertaking that complex surgery. So it adds to the sort of vertical integration that we're looking for from scan to surgery. And I see you've just picked up 25% of a 3D printing business by the name of Australian Additive Engineering. You've paid about 300000 for that 25%. Uh, Now, why are you getting into the 3D printing business? How does that dovetail in with what you do? So the 3D printing market is valued at the moment about $2.5 billion US a year, growing 15 to 20% per annum. Um, The reason that we got involved is that A, it will create the largest, single largest medically dedicated 3D printing facility in Australia, and B, it fits right into our scan to surgery initiative where our software will then integrate with their 3D printing process and print those implants. So patients will get a titanium implant, for example, for a spinal fusion or a implant to move their jaw forward a couple of millimetres. All that can now be patient-specifically printed in Melbourne and to the surgeons in less than two weeks. Okay, and just very quickly, how many people have now downloaded your 3D printing software and in how many countries? Yeah, so we've got uh, downloads now about eight to 9,000 and across 100 countries around the world. Tom Hanley from Singular Health, thanks for joining me today. And remember, Bulls and Bears is only here to give you information, not advice, which you should of course seek independently. I'm Matt Burney and this is Bulls and Bears. For more public company CEO interviews, go to the money page at 6pr.com.au and click the public companies tab.